Hey, this is Terry with Warshlog. Just a quick update on our J37 Honda swapped V6 into our 86 chassis 2013 FRS. What I've got here is a nearly 40 pound block of aluminum, which we will machine to make an adapter for this second gen J series bell housing to fit the second gen RX8 manual transmission. This 40 pound block will be machined down to about 12.3 pounds. The transmission should be here tomorrow. We're gonna to verify one thing on the input shaft and we'll start cutting metal hopefully Friday, if not Monday. We also have a big chunk of steel round bar that we procured to make an adapter for this eight bolt crank to this six bolt RX-8 flywheel. And again, once we have that, that'll all bolt up, fit inside this opening and fit inside the transmission. We've been working on this for about a month and maybe less than that. We've made big progress. Link ECU has a wiring harness they're putting together for us for a plug and play Link ECU potentially that solves all the CAN issues. They already make one for the FA20 and they've dedicated to make one for this J37 uh, engine. So that should make this swap tremendously easier. That's what bogs down all of our engine swaps is wiring. We'll put it in the chassis next week, make transmission crossover mounts, engine mounts, and we'll talk to Sean Yearwood at P2R, get his upper intake plenum, get the adapter uh, flanges for the exhaust, and we'll start bolting this thing together. Uh, we should have this thing running before the end of the year. That's the goal, and get it on track for next season where I'll be driving it in SECA Max 4. I might have to fight my wife for it. Um, one of us is going to be driving this, and one will be driving our Max 5 uh, 95 M3. So we'll have two different cars in the same category, but different classes. Uh, this one should have you know, about 50 more horsepower than we make in the uh, S53 liter. But uh, yeah, we should, uh, it should be a good season next year. We're excited to get this on track again. Anyway, that's it. Just a quick update on where we're at on October 8th, 2025. A lot of exciting plans for next year. Thanks for tuning in and we'll have more soon.